my name is Diana Stovo. I'm the author of Get Naked Fast. I'm a raw coach, motivational speaker. Uh, I also facilitate raw cleanses online at dianastovo.com. And i um, happy to be here. Thanks for coming. Yeah. So tell us how you got started. Well, I once weighed 247 pounds and I healed myself through food. Uh, I had a host of uh, medical issues and I just was tired of the med medical industry telling me what to do. So I started to strip away the foods that weighed me down and adding more live foods into my diet. And here I am, 12 years later, half the woman I used to be. <laughs> wow. Yeah. And how did you do that? What was your secret for losing half your weight? Just literally getting naked, which, which is what I call getting naked, um, is stripping away the foods that weigh you down and incorporating more live foods, regenerating the system, rebuilding it, uh, giving it live foods to uh, help the DNA kind of clean itself out and revive is what I did. Uh, did you, do you exercise? I walk. I do. I walk, I walk about five miles a day. It's one of my, I, I do call it my walking yoga meditation. It's oh, excellent. Nice. I look forward to it every morning. So tell us about the 10 day cleanses. So I'm facilitating what I call the Naked Challenge, which means it's a raw food cleanse or um, it, it, you can even have cooked foods, if it's soups and such, if you want. But coming off of uh, the standard American diet, 10 days can get you started into a healthy lifestyle. And people have had some amazing results. Usually I call, my whole website is 10, lose 10 pounds in 10 days and people lose between 9 and 12 pounds on the Naked Challenge. Not only that though, they get rid of their arthritic pain, they get off uh, depression medicine, their skin clears up, they sleep better, their stomachs go down, uh, digestion improves, it just goes on and on and on, all within 10 days. It's pretty phenomenal. What are your three best health tips? Drink lots of clear fluids, lots and lots of fluids. Make sure that most of the things you eat are liquid-based, meaning fruits and vegetables having 90 to 95% fluid uh, water in it. If you eat dry things, your body becomes dry. Um, get out in nature. You don't have to work out really hard, but you definitely want to experience movement in nature so that you get the negative ions. And um, be happy. Create happiness in your life. I think it's really important to have happiness in your life at all times. And if you find yourself going down that path where you're not finding happiness, then quickly make a switch before you go too deep. I would say those are my three best health tips. Okay. How about the three biggest mistakes that people make? Uh, the three biggest mistakes that people make are not trusting their body and listening to outside information, people telling you what you should put in. Um, the, the, the shoulds and should nots would be another mistake. Anybody who uh, puts a label on I should or should not is already creating a negative vibration in their healing process. And um, again, I would have to say uh, if you're not enjoying your healing process, then you're not healing. So that would be another mistake. This is not a uh, thing you have to get through to get to the other side. It's actually a lifestyle that you want to incorporate into your world. How about your definition of health? Feeling everything completely and, um, and bearing witness to the, the experience of your life. And that means for health, it means if in fact you find yourself coming across challenges or adversity in your life, just embrace it and own it and let it flow through you. Um, I don't think disease can stick in a flowing environment. Well, if you're building your immune system, which you will through live food, by putting more live food into your body, you're actually creating a live environment where everything is kind of vibrating at a higher level. So things will come in and out of your life, but if your immune system is tough, it'll just pass you right by. When in fact you do get ill, uh, flow with it. Your body needs to, once in a while, just detox. And sometimes we get immune, um, we get viruses or infections to help us detox process. You know, the runny nose, the headaches, the fevers, all that. It's actually kind of good for us to get a download once in a while.